Hello, 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 Tanya's Turo. And thank you guys for tuning in. This is going to be an Air Element Read. This is for my Aquarius is Gemini's and Libra's. What's coming in for my Air Elements in Love? What do they need to know about their relationships, their connections at this time? This is going to be a general read, baby, so it may or may not resonate with you. Take what does, leave what does, and energy is fluid, so feel free to flip it, switch it. Put yourself where you fit right up in it. And last but not least, any pronoun that I use, he, she, her, him, is speaking of masculine or feminine energies, unless otherwise stated, guys, okay? So if it's an actual person, I will tell you. If not, then it's just the energies, and feel free to flip you, you know, the energies with you and your person. One final shuffle, Aquarius, Gemini, Libras. And the Father, the Son, Holy Spirit. And I do need it to jump. What is coming in for my Aquarius, Libras, and Gemini's in love? Okay, so first card out for you guys is romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring in this connection, guys. Another one for my Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. What's coming in for love for them? There's some type of deception around you guys, though, okay? Someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship. Someone, somebody could be hiding their feelings, not telling you how they truly feel. Or you could be hiding your feelings from someone. There could be some type of third-party situation here. It could be somebody... Um, they're still dealing with their baby's mother in some type of sense or form or way. They still have an attachment to a baby's mother here. Give me one more. I gave me two. So I'm going to take them. We have separation here. So it says time apart from your partners on the horizon. Okay, so you may have found out that there was some type of third party situation going on here. With this person, you probably could have went and explored your feelings with this person. You thought what you felt for this person was real. And you found out that this person was lying to you. There could have been some type of third-party situations here. Um, and you walked away from this situation here. There was a separation. Time apart, time apart from your partner is on the horizon. But Spirit says stay optimistic about your love life, okay? I do feel like there's something new that's going to come in here for you. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance, okay? After this ending from this third party situation here. I do feel like you really thought that this person you were dealing with was the one. You thought this was your person. And this person lied to you. This person played games with you. They played with your feelings here. And I do feel like if you haven't walked away from your person, you're in the process of about to walk away from your person. Spirit says, you know, stay optimistic. It could be about you and this person. Or this could be, you know, somebody new that's going to treat you right. That's not going to put you in third-party situations. But you have to remain positive, guys. Don't let the negative thinking come in. Okay? Because it's going to get you stuck and stagnant. In the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini coming in for them for love clarify romantic feelings for me okay yeah so there was some type of illusion some type of lies somebody lied about their feelings somebody was faking the funk about how they felt about somebody like i said there could have been some type of third party situation there could have been a baby here tell me more about romantic feelings and this illusion and i do need it to jump Okay, yeah, there's no more forward movement here because of this lie and this deception. Tell me more, Spirit. Did somebody lost all respect for this person. Whatever this lie was, yeah. I do feel like this person is trying to hold on to you or to your to or you're trying to hold on to your person somebody's trying to hold on here somebody doesn't want this to be over even though they got caught in this lie tell me more yeah this person is really passionate about you or you may still be passionate about this person 
I do feel like they want a new a, a new beginning here. They want to come in and offer you this this love. Or they want to hold on to this love. This person could have lied to you and told you that they wanted to hold on to this love. Thank you, spirit. That they wanted this connection with you. That they loved you. They wanted to be there with you. And you found out that <laughs> this was all a lie. It was an illusion. And there was no forward movement here in this connection. Thank you, Spirit. Tell me about separation. Clarify separation for me. Yeah, so somebody was very possessive. Very possessive here, right? And you've had to walk away. Somebody's possibly trying to still hold on to you, but you walked away. You, you wanted to walk away from conflict and move to something peaceful here. And now you're in hermit mode. You're by yourself. You're introspecting. You're looking back at how things happened, what happened, the way things went down. The fact that this person truly lied to you and played you here. The Spirit says it's okay. Forgive this person. Okay? Take the lesson out of this and move forward here, babies. Okay? Don't get stuck in this. Karma's a motherfucker. Don't, don't try to get revenge or anything like that. Let that person go. Stay in your hermit mode. Keep working on yourself. Okay? And stay optimistic about your love life. You do have somebody who's going to come in and love you and treat you the way you're supposed to be treated. Tell me more, Spirit. Thank you. Yeah, Spirit says trust. There's going to be somebody that wants to come in and take this leap of faith with you after you come out of this hermit mode, after you come out of this healing period. Okay? Don't give up. There will be a new beginning. A nine going into the zero. Endings here to new beginnings. Tell me more from my prayers. But yeah, Spirit says have courage. Move forward. Don't be afraid to trust again. Don't be afraid to love again. Okay, don't let what happened bet with you and between you and this person over here affect your future. When when you forgive, release this, okay? Do not carry this with you. While you're in hermit mode, it's time to heal and release it. Do not move forward and have any type of feelings towards this when you move forward, guys, okay? And trust that there is a new beginning coming in for you. There will be somebody that's going to come in that wants to take this leap of faith with you. And when this person comes in, Spirit says, have courage. Do not allow what happened to you in the past to, to make you be fearful to take this leap of faith with this new beginning. Tell me more, Spirit. Yeah. Hold strong to your vision here, okay? And whatever bad habits there is, this fear, this negativity, um, any addiction, it's time to release these things while you're still in hermit mode. And hold strong to your vision. Okay, guys. So, I'm going to um, pull from this, the sexual tarot deck. If you're under 18, you need to click off now. If you have a problem with any type of sexual content, then um, right now is a good time to take off for you guys, okay? Let's see. If we have any final messages for my Aquarius, Libra, and Geminis at this time, what do you need to know? In the name of the Father, the Son, Holy Spirit. Final messages, advice for Aquarius, Libra, Gemini in this connection. Okay, Six of Pentacles. There is something balanced, the equal give and take coming into you guys after a period of healing for swords. This new person um, could either be watching you. You could see this person. You might already know this person here. I do feel like um, this new person, when you guys come into this connection, that there will be a lot of oral going on. This person, if you're a man, this woman will have breasts that you like, um, uh, ass that you like. I do feel like you'll be sexually attracted to this person, okay? This person will be sexually attracted to you as well. Yeah, this person coming in will be stable. They will have their own money. They could possibly have a feet, feet fetish. Woman or man. I do feel like you guys are both going to have, you know, the physique that each other likes. So whatever your type is, this person will be your type and, and, and opposite. You know what I'm saying? 
Ten of Pentacles, this person wants to come in or will come in and want to build with you something long-term, stable, committed here. That's why Spirit says hold on, okay? After you heal, you have somebody that's going to come in. This Ten of Pentacles is um, the husband, the wife, the kids. This is building wealth, leaving, leaving generational wealth. A legacy here. Stability, okay? So you have somebody that's going to come in for the long haul here. Okay. Yeah, so you have temperance here. So there will be a balance coming in. Could be a Sagittarius that comes through here. The Six of Wands here. Um, this is moving away from emotional conflict and moving towards something peaceful here to your happiness. Okay. Once you balance these feelings and emotions from this person that hurt you in the past. Okay. Move away from this emotional conflict and heal. There is happiness, babies. And it's going to be fun, too. Okay? This sex life will be fun. This person will like your ass or like ass. Okay? They will like to be naked. This person will like to kiss you. This person is going to like your feet. They're going to like your mouth. Okay? They're going to possibly want to feed you some things. At the bottom of the deck, we had a ten of cups. So you get the ten of pentacles and the ten of cups. You get emotional and um, physical stability here. Okay, so I'm going to leave this here, guys. Hopefully it resonated with you. Let me know down in the comment section. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share. Also, um, if you're interested in booking a personal, buying any of my products, leaving a tip or donation, or checking out any of my other channels, all that information is in the description box below. So until next time, my babies, <laughs> you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Bye, TT babies.